Hello Libra, welcome to my channel. My name is Rose and I'm here to bring you another weekly love read. These are for entertainment purposes only guys, so just take what you need and leave what doesn't apply. Um, we're going to ask the tarot cards today, what is in this person's head and heart? So how are they thinking and feeling towards you um, in this connection, in this relationship or towards a situation that you're both facing right now? Okay, so if you do enjoy this reading, Libra, let me know by liking, sharing and or subscribing here today. Okay, straight up, we've got the Emperor card coming through. This is strong masculine energy. Uh, this person may feel very protective towards you. I'm getting that with the Mother of Wands. It could be an air, so uh, sorry, it could be an Aries with the Emperor, with the Mother of Wands. It could be another fire sign. Uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, but strong Aryan energy coming through. I do feel like this person, yeah, they're coming through as protective. Um, like the emperor, like the it's this big tree and it stands tall. Um, this person feels proud. Okay, this person feels proud to have someone like you in their life. They're proud to show you off. They may even be coming through in the upcoming week is proud to show you off maybe to take it to social media maybe show you off to family and friends okay um i'm getting a good posturing coming through when it comes to this person uh generally speaking you know some of the shadow traits of the emperor is uh controlling but i'm not getting that i'm getting more protective energy OK, this is someone you can really lean on um, this. They may even come through and let you know, hey, if there's anything you need, you can lean on me. Um, you can feel safe around the emperor. You can be sure that the emperor will deliver on his promises. OK. This person is coming through like they're thinking like how can I show my Libra that I care about them, I love them, that I'm serious. Like I'm just getting that this Emperor is in serious mode, like serious. This person may even, in, in their mind, they want to build something with you. They want to build something with standing, long standing here. I do get with the Mother of Wands protective energy, just with these two touching each other. Uh, yeah, feeling very protective. Um, you can see in this card, the Mother of Wands is protecting three eggs. Okay, so th those eggs can speak to birth children uh, something that you're building together uh, there's creative sparks flying through the mother of wands as well the mother of wands is also an energy of someone who is feeling inspired empowered also very sexual the mother of wands is very sexual okay uh, so this person may feel attracted to you sexually physically uh, you do tick all the boxes here with the nine of cups for this person they feel like you tick all the all the boxes for them you are their wish come true or they see you as their wish fulfillment here I'm also seeing this, these nine cups, they're kind of shaped like a horseshoe. So they feel lucky to have you. I see the horseshoe, especially facing upwards like this, that this is a lucky, like a lucky charm or a lucky symbol. So this person feels lucky to have you in their life. Uh, they are lucky to have met you. Um, they would feel lucky to like win your love um but ultimately you make this person happy emotionally speaking this person is happy 
and contented and fulfilled with you here. It's like they cannot get enough of you. I feel like this person wants to squeeze you or hug you. Um, I'm seeing a smile on their face as well. Um, I feel like this person is willing to come through um, like compromising something with you. I'm seeing these two of uh, pentacles as, I don't know how to actually word it, but I, I feel like this is like a dynamic duo, like see those two pentacles they're connected in with the figure eight symbol um so this person feels a strong connection to you and they also think that you're a good fit or a good match for them i feel like some, there's something balanced here they feel balanced with you libra um so if this is someone who's quite fiery or reactive or uh, passionate, sometimes this person can come a bit aggressive. I feel like that you calm them down or you balance them out in some way. Okay, I do feel like this person is willing to evolve with the butterfly. Okay, they're willing to make changes. Um, I do feel like at the moment they may be juggling in between two priorities. But I feel like they're doing it for the for your future. Does that make sense, Libra? Okay, this person is stepping up or this person wants to step up. And as a result of maybe the responsibilities that this person has got going on, they've got a lot on their plate right now they are juggling maybe work and the relationship family and social life okay um but you will see this person go through some kind of some kind of a metamorphosis this person is willing to change and transform for you, they're willing to change how they act or behave for the connection just so there's more peace, more harmony, um, especially if there hasn't been up to this point. Okay. But overall, this person feels lucky to have you. Uh, they do feel sexually attracted to you. They want to protect you and I, I see them wanting to hug you. It's like this person, I'm seeing their arms wrapped around you and it's like they don't want to let you go. But maybe through this connection that they have with you, they, this person feels like they can spread their wings. So they might even tell you this, Libra. They may even tell you, you know, thank you, Libra. Without you, I wouldn't have been able to make this move or take this risk or take a chance here. It's through you um, I've been able to evolve. Mm, I see that. So this is why they feel lucky to have you. Because I see this person spreading their wings here. And it's due to the connection. They couldn't have done this without you. And I feel like they will let you know. So there we have it, Libra. I hope you enjoyed this read. And until next time, take care.